right, ma'am. Hey Thanks. Support we your back team. at it, boy. Who is that? Thank you. Hey guys. What is, who is this? Hope you can make it. Fake like ass Wendy. The girls volleyball team has a big game tonight, and we're just asking for people to come cheer us on. Girls volleyball. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, he asshole, bro. I'll rip your asshole, bro. <laughs> uh, sorry, we're actually busy. What's wrong with supporting girls athletics? Dude, girls should totally be allowed to play sports. You just can't expect people to want to watch. Okay? Yeah, right. No, 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 no. Now, women's volleyball is very interesting. Tennis, women's tennis, very interesting. Oh, that Venus and Serena. That's a nice act. That's a nice performance. That is a nice performance. That is that is a good performance. That is that is real good. Real good. Real good performance. Now, I ain't gonna lie, bro. I used to laugh at women's bas basketball. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I used to laugh at this shit. But in recent years, maybe not even years, in recent months, <laughs> within the last five, I've checked out a few. And, and you know, I got a favorite player. I'm sure it's everybody's. And, and you know, I'm just thinking like, ah, nah, nah, but no. It has not, just not yet. It's not yet. It's not yet. But it's coming you know, soon. But it's not yet. And all we keep hearing is, we're too busy. But we actually are busy. Women Tonight are good at sports. A lot of sports, what too. What fight? Dude, Kenny. Oh, oh t pause, pause. I'm going to bring it back. I'm going to bring it back. I'm going to bring it back. I know y'all tripping. Y'all going to start tripping. Women UFC. W not women's UFC, but the uh, women in UFC. That shit. They be going, Ronda, the boy, you better stop. You better stop, boy. They be going ham. You know what I'm saying? They be going crazy, bro. I can now. I can get behind that. Yeah, right. You know, we're actually in the playoffs, and all we keep hearing is we're too busy. But we actually are busy. Tonight's the big fight. What fight? Between who? Dude, Kenny is fighting Slaughterhouse tonight. I mean, no offense, but we're not gonna miss the fight for girls volleyball. <laughs> <laughs> That's a yeah, so, sorry, you're not getting any spectators, but there's hardcore dude shit to watch. Well, who is he fighting, bro? Like, a Yu-Gi-Oh game? Blue Eyes White Dragon. Okay, I can, let me stop, bro. I was on that shit heavy. I had a dual disc and everything, bitch. I used to play. Boy, I, hey, look. I used to be like, boy, they, nowadays, we have the technology for that shit to be possible. That's what I loved about Yu-Gi-Oh before I started getting all weird and shit like that. But, I mean, it did have an element of that anime, you know, stuff like that. Yu-Gi-Oh was an anime, but to me, it was more of a cartoon. To me, it was more of a... It was like one of those cartoons that just transcended, like Dragon Ball. Dragon Ball is an OG anime. Dragon Ball Z was an anime, but it was so much... In America, it was, it's so much ingrained in American culture that it's hard to even just call it an anime. It transcends. It transcends. It's just it's just Dragon Ball Z, Dragon Ball. You know what I'm saying? You know. So, anyways, Yu Yu Gi Oh. Let me just keep going. My bad. My bad. My bad. Why is he making noise? I'm going to play a fifth mana card. Mana card. And I'm going to attack with my elder beast. Hold on. Wait, hold on. <laughs> do what you gotta do. Can Kenny block his elder beast? Not with his shapeshifter, it's already tapped. This asshole needs to make a move already. Quiet in the peanut gallery, please. Right. I am attacking, <laughs> but with a newly summoned spark ghast who has trample, four damage to your planeswalker. Oh! Damn. No. Look, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm talking about damn and shit. I don't even know what the hell going on. Shh, but he's dying. But he's dying. <laughs> This late? How do you see it? He just stacked a shapeshifter with an elven blade. How do you see that, bro? You know what I'm saying? I can block that with uprooted minotaur. Oh. What? What did he do? Yeah. He won. No. Get your bitch ass on some. No, just so stupid ass. He's a he's a pedo, bro. He touches he he he, he touches himself, bro. He's stupid. Dude, it was complete <laughs> he's brutality. A kid. You've never seen anything so ruthless it was seriously almost hard to watch at one point kenny actually polymorphed the dude into a blue frog with an instant attack card it was it's carnage bro wendy did you hear about last night yeah i heard the girls volleyball team won by like 20 points not bad <laughs> did you actually go oh, to that God. yeah you should show your support too sometime Pff, whatever That's, i can respect dude, I that sometime at least it was such 
ponage, it was almost repulsive. Hey, Psst. come over here. What are you on? You guys like hardcore stuff, huh? No, we don't, bitch. The fuck wrong with you? Hey, Psst. hey, come on over here. You like hardcore? No, bro. You like hardcore stuff with fucking dudes, bro. Yeah, well, you boys want to get in on some real action? If you like excitement, I'm not talking about the little boy stuff. I'm talking real man shit. He needs to go to jail. Well then, if you want to see real fights with real brutality, go here. This is the I... underground stuff, so keep it quiet. And what you are you giving this to? Barf bag. You might want to pack a barf bag. Bitch, you might want to pack a, a set of clippers. Trim that bitch shit up. Unless you drive a motorcycle, that shit is not legal. It's that this is not legal. I need to, I can't talk. I need to get my shit together, you know, but I'm, but I'm doing this for you, but I'm doing this for you, man. We out there having fun. We getting, uh, uh, um, pussy. Yeah. <laughs> Possibly. Should be the next one. Two, seven, seven, eight, Mala Vista Drive. Wait, I love that how they formed walk. the town. What's exciting and hardcore about shitty shrimp? Like they gave her a, like a real open. look to South Park. We cross. We quote for tonight. Go away, praise. Uh, yeah. Mitchell, the janitor, sent us. You parades? What? You parades? look like police. <laughs> okay, come on, come on. Five dollar. Five dollar each. Come on, five dollar. Five dollar. <laughs> <laughs> hey, now that nigga is the real freak. I remember him on that episode. That boy, that boy was, uh, he was two, he do different people. He two, he not Chinese. He's not Chinese. He's not Brock. You know, Brock ain't never see. They made that boy. It's only one black. He was the actual black uh, character in, in Pokemon from the original series. They made that nigga blind. His daddy left. His mama dead. He ain't had. He, he always trying to get some puss. He don't never get none. He was a gym leader. He left his responsibilities to travel around with kids. They destroyed him. Do you see what I'm saying? They did Brock bad. I have not, like he was the only straight up black character. They even gave him that Bart haircut. I could tell that shit was nappy and everybody had that haircut. I mean, everybody had those spikes and shit, but I could tell his was nappy because he was black. And I'm not saying there was anything wrong with nappy hair, or curly hair. That's not what I'm saying. I'm just saying I noticed it. Why the hell did they have to make this man? And you're gonna, you're, you're just gonna say, well, but his dad came back, but his little dad left. You get what I'm saying? Well, well, technically, what happened to Ash's dad? Is that nigga dead or something? That nigga left, he went out for some milk. He went out for a Bulbasaur and he never came go back. Go this, we in the I shouldn't fight. make fun of that. Go, 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 go. I shouldn't make fun of that. What happened to Ash's dad, bro? I really wanna know. Cause I know Professor Oak was ramming that shit. His mom <laughs> put that muck on her face. What is this? Scrambles plays a black swamp mana card. Oh, shut up! Fluffy comes shut with up. a mana card of his own. Shut. And he plays a fugitive wizard. All right, so this this ain't well. well okay, all right, no cockfight. No, this is what we got here, bro. Mana fight. And yes, that is crippling blood. Crippling blight to the fugitive wizard. Creature now you? has minus one to strength and defense. More mana he from could Fluffy. Be now he'll attack with fugitive wizard. And there's an instant attack from Scrambles that is peeled from reality. Fugitive wizard is literally torn apart from the battleground. What? The mana is flying now as both roosters play sorcery spells. It's mass calcify oh, against God. into the void. <laughs> Do they even know what they're doing at this point? <laughs> Dude, that was total carnage. That was freaking hardcore. Can you believe that rooster played a Colonian twin grove with half his mana? What's wrong with Kenny? It was just decimation. It was really about the most man thing I think we've ever been a part of. We're going again on Friday, right? Hell yeah. <laughs> Y'all gonna go to jail, bitch. I don't I don't even think that shit's still legal. Messing with South Park. Kenny. <laughs> What's mean about it? I don't know exactly. Oh, Carmen's getting ready to tell us. I apologize. They're bad for the roosters. Yeah, I feel bad for the roosters. Look, who's to say the roosters don't want to play? I mean, they were going at it. 
They were forced to, bro. I mean, they put you in the room and put everybody around you and said that you had to do this shit. I think you'd be forced to do Pretty this hard. shit. Yeah, maybe that's just kind of what you do naturally. Guys, I think maybe Kenny's a little hurt because he was the big magic champion and now chickens are stealing his thunder. No. Huh? A little bit? No. Dude, maybe you know a little we bit. <laughs> we should all go in on a rooster. Dude, totally. With Kenny's magic skills, we could probably kick Siri's ass. What do you think, Kenny? Would that make you feel better, huh? Come on, where's that smile? Where's that smile, Kenny? I mean, I've never seen this man smile. Well, I have seen him smile, bro, on the South Park movie. I'll take that Kenny, back. I think he's smiling, you guys. I don't think he likes it, bro. <laughs> Hello, Mr. McCormick. Surprised oh, to see us. What do you made? Let's cut the crap, <laughs> huh? We know there's an illegal cock magic ring going on in town. We just want to know who's leading it. Right. What's cock magic? Freak. Right. Roosters are being forced against their will to play Magic the Gathering, and you know nothing about it because you're white. Let's get something straight. <laughs> Cock magic isn't an Asian thing or a Mexican thing. White people do it too if they're poor enough. You got a jumped oh, car no. in your front yard, Mr. McCormick. Care to tell us where the Cock Magic fights are being held? I don't go to any Cock Magic <laughs> fights. He got stereotyped, bro, because he's white and poor. That's crazy, bro. I, I, you know, and I've seen it a lot in my life, bro, and it's just, it's like, it's very, it's, it's racist. It's racist. But I've seen, <laughs> there's, there's only, not, I'm, I'm not, okay, so I'm saying this with a disclaimer. Um, this is what I've seen. This is not personally what I believe in. This is what I've seen. This is some things that I've heard of. And, um, and basically, <laughs> It's like, it's nothing, okay, like, I've heard that, you know, black people get treated a certain way. You know, you you know that, and it is what it is. Um, <laughs> Arab people get treated a little worse. Uh, Indian people, yeah, it is what it is. But what I'm, what I'm getting at, I'm trying to give you a, a bit of a disclaimer because I don't want to say anything that's totally fucked up. But, like, poor white people get treated almost worse than everybody because and this is what i've heard that they that it's just like it's just, it's it's a horrible situation it's like it's like you got black people and and police problems right and then you got poor white people get the same police problems it's, it's like it's like i baffled I was baffled when I found out. I was just like, are you serious? And this is a bit of a stereotype, a lot of racism. You know what I'm saying? So I had to teeter the line. But I think you understand what I'm talking about. You know what I'm saying? Because it's just like this is a, a big society in which a lot of people don't like to talk about race, but it honestly is a big deal. I think, honestly, me personally, I think that America has dealt with race better than most of the places in the world. We've confronted racism forefront, right in your face. We make jokes about it. We laugh about it. We've been breathing it. And I think over this period of time, black people, white people, just, just black and white people, let's just stick with black and white people for us. The black and the white Americans, I think that we've grown to appreciate each other. I think that we've grown to understand that a lot of things that we do aren't as far off as we think. Some black people like drink. Some white people like juice. But then you have these people in the middle that like both. Me, motherfucker. You, make, you understand that? I, I, me. You understand that? I shop at Whole Foods as well. But here's the thing. I don't do it for every single thing. I got to go to certain places. And that's where you see people mixing in with each other. Black men and white men have been able to come together in these, in these last years to, to, because there's one thing that really brings us together. Our women are crazy. <laughs> you understand that? And we love y'all to death. We do. We honestly do. I, I love, I love y'all to death. White women, black women. Just amazing. And, and all, everywhere, Asian women too, is, you know, it's all, it's all love everywhere. But what I'm trying to say, just specifically, what the fuck was that? Specifically, white men and black men, we have a great understanding that these women are crazy. You understand that? Do you get that? We have, we have bonded over that. 
It's just like I, I remember one white man, he looked at me, he was just his woman was going off and then and mine was beginning, you know what I'm saying, in the early stages of it's hot and, and I'm hungry and 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 you're not paying attention to me. And I looked at him and he looked at me. And from that point on, we were we had connected. We had a talk. We, I'm talking about, that's one of my, that's one of my closest friends. David, I'm talking about you, David. He knows. I can't say too much. I can't say too much, but he knows. We bonded over that moment. He like, you want a beer? I don't drink beer. You want to smoke? You damn right. Now I don't smoke anymore, but man, I'm telling you, bro, that that's, that's what I'm saying. We bonded over the fact that our, 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 our woman was crazy, crazy as hell. And, uh, and you know, it, it's an amazing thing. And you just start to realize that people aren't so different. I'm sorry, what were we doing? Oh, my bad, my bad. I apologize. But we're just not that different. We all like grape soda, chicken, and watermelon, okay? We bond over chicken as well. Do you have any sympathy at all for the animals, Mr. McCormick? Can you and imagine cigarettes. being kept in a small cage, <laughs> barely able to turn around? Cigarettes. I don't like And then finally let out only to be blasted by Arctic ice spells and legendary creature cards? It's illegal and it's wrong. And anyone wrong. <laughs> involved with this filth is going down. Now, I don't want to lecture anybody, but what you boys are getting involved in is dangerous. Dad, <laughs> it's not that big a deal. It is a big deal, okay? People can get hurt. Believe it or not, I was into cock magic back in college. I bet you, you were. Worse. Yeah, so I'm not some buddy duddy who. <laughs> nah, I, he's a freak. I forgot Randy's a freak for this too, bro. Get it. I just want to make sure if you boys do it, you do it right <laughs> and safely. You need to do that shit with a condom. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me try not to laugh. Let me... That is disgusting. Dad, that's not that's not cock magic. <laughs> Oh, I'm not impressed. How about this? <laughs> he retracted it back, but that's disgusting. What is it? That's Hello? the nasty We're shit. We're looking to buy a rooster that can play Magic the Gathering? Never heard of cock magic or roosters. He never said nothing about cock magic. Uh, we aren't cops or anything. That's all it Come took, huh? Come on back, don't mind the smell. We only deal in the highest quality Shit, yes. poultry planeswalkers. Are you looking for a New Hampshire or a Cornish breed? We don't really know the difference. Well, your New Hampshire broiler chickens are the best for white mana. These okay. here have been raised to play mostly protection spells and do well with sorcery cards. And here you got mm. your green mana necromancers. Lots of earthy growth and hindering incantations that are good against blue or black stack decks. Oh, he got a, he got a deck of cards in there with them. This is this is still horrible, Loki. You think they're happy? Hell no, then. Do I think they're happy? Yeah, like, you think they mind being made to play Magic the Gathering? Hell yes. They're f***ing chickens. Well, our friend <laughs> here has some animal rights concerns. Do you have any free-range chickens? Free-range chickens are primarily control deck players that slow the game down with board control cards. Oh, no, damn. Screw the free-range chickens, huh, Kenny? <laughs> hey, right. this little guy? Ugh. That one's... That look like my homeboy Nugget. <laughs> if I've ever seen a chicken named Nugget, that is <laughs> that's horrible. That but that chicken got an afro. Kind of young. I don't even know what kind of cards he prefers. Then he's perfect for us. That's ass what should ketchup. we name him, Kenny? I know. How about McNuggets? Hey McNuggets, <laughs> you wanna come play for us? <laughs> that's <laughs> horrible. Oh wow! Did you hear him, Kenny? Set up. Carmen is an asshole, Mom, will bro. you tell Dad to get out of the bathroom? He's been in there for an hour. I'm surprised that they only have one bathroom in the whole house because that's a pretty big house. I mean, because they got a ah, yeah, that is really. I, it's not too surprising. And look at look, look at this is my privilege. We we only had one. Ba we had two bathrooms, but only one of them was functional. The other one was beat to shit, and that's a whole another story. But um, so I, I understand it, but I'm just saying, like, it's very interesting because, you know, um, the buildings in South Park, they they look they look pretty big. They look pretty big, but that makes sense. Though. I would Randy. think they would have a half bath downstairs. Hey. I don't know why. Oh, oh thank you. <laughs> Randy, what are you doing? Oh, nothing, Sharon. <laughs> Boy, whipping Strolling this shit out. If you don't mind. Hey. Randy, he's doing a high. Playing. 
And where do the drums come from? Is what I want to know. All right, Zip Sharon. Shit up. I'm practicing. Cock magic is making a comeback. Oh, no, no, oh, yes, no, 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 no. Sharon, I don't know why or how, but people all over town are talking about it again. Now, you know that I was one of the best back in college. I know that's why you got kicked out of college. Because people oh, didn't shit. understand. People were afraid, Sharon. But now culture is caught. He has a whole... Wait, 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 wait. This nigga got a band in there. He got an old guy, look like Walter White, in the bathroom with a with some drums, and you have the the, the nerve, the the uh, mitigating gall. I've always wanted to say that. You get you got that. I'm I'm, I'm not gonna try to say it again because that's what I'm gonna fuck it up and shit. I'm, 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 so you got that. You do that, and but you got a nerve to pull your shit out in the bathroom. With the old man playing the drums. You don't see anything wrong with this? Up. And even our son is discovering what cock magic has to offer. Stanley? People are going to oh, do no. it, Sharon. And it's up to the professionals to make sure it's handled the right way. Oh. Oh, my God. What? <laughs> you freaky bitch. You. you. He's almost like, ha. Silk black spider can't oh, walk shit. as if it had flying. Go to go to a museum and and put on a show. <laughs> go to a museum, bro. Like just just offer that at the museum. And now give me he a bad bitch. Give her a little bit of cock magic of my own. Damage to McNuggets. Come on, McNuggets, fight! You can do it, McNuggets. That's it. Oh, Quiet, double please. Nothing, double double nothing right. on the next one. Wait. McNuggets has cast punishing fire, absorbing the ghost flame and dealing two damage. McNugget one. That's not good. It's like it's like calling them McNugget is like, look, hey, just letting you know, if you don't make it, if you don't do what we need you to do, your name. McNugget. That's what you gonna you be. The right that, was was that was goddamn manly. I mean, no offense to Kenny, but that shit made regular Magic the Gathering look like girls' body bop. Excuse Damn. me. Oh that no. Was pretty impressive down there. Morpheus. Your boys have a nice cock. And no. Get the hell away from them, you freak. Freaky ass n <laughs> He didn't have to say that. He literally could have said chicken. Mentals, you boys have a nice... Nah, bro, you're a freaky ass dude, Thank bro. you so very much. I've never seen a rooster throw down spells with such raw brutality. How would you, you like to move him up to the big time? You mean there's more to this? Oh, yes. And I'm not talking about the basement of some seedy Chinese restaurant. I'm talking about the basement of a well-established Chinese franchise. No, Saturday what is that? Night. Here's the address. Panda Express. We'll I know where I got to be. Your cock can really make. Gee, thanks. <laughs> what do you think, Jigglos? <laughs> You're going to the big leagues. <laughs> gonna show your cock okay, to everybody, huh? Time for our birthday show. Everyone, let's be quiet now. Come on. Yeah, a show, a show. Do you kids Who like said that? Yeah. I don't miss it. Let's all give a cheer for the amazingly Randy. Yeah. Yeah. No, you what? freaky bitch. You going to jail, Randy? No, Randy, Randy, you're going to jail. He's going to jail. You understand that? He's going to jail. He's going to be in jail by, if, if this is if this is 11 a.m., he's going to be in jail by 2 p.m. By 2 p.m., he's going to be in jail explaining himself. Oh, They're going to tear goes. you up. Anyone see my hat? Okay, the magician started. Let's get the cake ready. He's not a magician, bitch. <laughs> you, you... You should have seen a little bit of his act. I blame the parents. I blame it's blame them. Now, some of you might think that this Ooh. is a little crazy, but if you believe in magic, uh -uh. you'll find that. Oh, 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 God. oh no! Somebody help, please! Oh, they're getting a kick out of the magician, huh? No, they're somebody not. Get some of you. <laughs> they're little traumatized. Girl, please just, just check behind your ear. Whoa, no. <laughs> she handed it to him. What is that? That is disgusting. It was behind her ear. And there we go. We're all better. And I am the amazingly Randy. Thank you. Go home. I hate you too. Dude, it was so I hate badass. Too. Our guy slaughtered every other fighter there. And now he's moving up to the real hardcore shit. It was seriously about the greatest night of our lives. Where was all this? 
We can't tell you, bro. It's like hardcore underground shit. Yeah, Just stop you talking about it. Dang it, I wish I knew people. All right, kids, Sorry, before we get food. started, the okay. coach of the girls' volleyball team is here and would like to say a few words. Thank you, Mr. Garrison. Listen. Damn, bitch. Linebacker. Ugly ass. Just say you know what Ugh, boy. She got some big ass tits, boy. She about put you in a full Nelson just to fuck you. Uh, last night we had a pretty big game against Evergreen. The girls really hammered them, but once again, we're uh, a little disappointed in the turnout. Oh, right. Jesus, give it a rest already. <laughs> you know, when you put your all into something, it's kind of a bummer when people don't seem to care. Kind of makes you feel you. like the sport you love is becoming a joke. Dude, girls volleyball isn't a joke. Jokes are hard and require skill. Oh, <laughs> damn, bro. <laughs> That's rough. Boy, you know your girlfriend going to give you hell for that. Volleyball jokes did. <laughs> the girls wanted to say something, so we're now going to hear a few words from the captain of the girls volleyball team. Damn. Wendy? Hey guys, these games coming up are really big, and it would mean a lot to us if you could try and make it. Thanks. Oh, damn. Yeah, that's your girlfriend, bitch. Dude, Wendy plays volleyball. You never you knew that. that? No, he did. He, <laughs> he never knew that, bro. And then he uh, took his penis from behind our daughter's ear, and uh, <laughs> we uh, and that's when we saw him with uh, the the three rings and his penis. He was pulling it through him somehow. Uh, uh-huh. And what about the cock magic? Where was that? No, that's what I'm telling you. It was right here, except except for the thing where he poured the milk into his penis. He did that over there. All right. What? Nah, he nah, Randy is Mr. Garrison, Randy, and that and that fake ass Asian man. They are right on par. I'm I, look, I need please, I need someone's help. Real quick. Reach out to me. I need someone's help. I need to go. I need somebody. Reach out to me on Discord. Do this shit as soon as you get a chance. Discord is free. You can download it. We got a community over there. And trust me, it, we have a blast over there. But reach out to me on Discord. I need somebody to help me put together a freak list. A list of all the freaks on South Park. I need some research. We need. Gotta, I need some help. I need help, but please reach out to me. We have to make this list. All right, now. let's try and focus. We what have kind to. of decks were they And using? there will be payment involved. Decks? Who? There, there weren't any decks. Just dicks. Oh, <laughs> I get it now. Do you know what the penalty is for calling in a false cock magic report? Oh, I'm no. I'm so confused, babe. Who They're paid you to change. call us and take our focus away from the investigation? What color were they? Nobody paid us what any. What color? No. There is Black? Been a crime here, and you better do something about it. Agreed. Who first called 911? Please, oh, she's going take to me away from my child. <laughs> Mommy! I mean, this is traumatic for the child. Sink the dick today and then all this, and now your mom got taken away. What's going on? What's going on? 1421 Plaza Day, a stereotypo. Wow, here we are, McNuggets. You've reached the big time. Panda Express, I told you. I told you. I love it. Sorry, Panda Express is crossed. We crossed. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're here for the cock magic. Uh, then why the hell are you there? Sorry, Panda Express is crossed. We crossed. No, you ain't closed, bitch. Okay, come on. Ten dollar. Ten dollar. Obvious. Ten dollar. Ten dollar. For the next round. Oh, it is that's a that's a big cock. <laughs> Who is that? That's Panda. Hey, I'm. Girl, all in pause, bro. He's never lost a fight. <laughs> Hell, he's never even lost one health. Oh, bro, this is stupid, bro. I hate them so much. And Stan forced to be there. Is he a red mage or a green mage? Dude, he's like a beast. He's got more legendary creature cards than I've ever seen. Bro, just use the damn. Bro, use FaceTime, bro. What are y'all doing? McNuggets is scared. He doesn't want to play. McNuggets is scared, dude. Can you stack his deck with more mana? Nobody is Can there. you stack McNugget's deck with more mana? Stop he screaming. Chance. Not one spell cast before he was obliterated by health drains. That thing isn't human. What? It's not supposed to be. <laughs> what kind I of chain on? The up next, boys. I don't think he wants to play, dude. He doesn't have a choice. But this isn't even a fight. This is just a slaughter. What do you think all these people are here to see? Oh, oh damn. Dude, dude, reform it, reform it. The hell you do. Get your cock in there. Shut up, freak. You're watching oh. ESPN Illegal. You're 
ESPN e League. Source for bullfighting, dogfighting, and cock magic. Oh and shit! A warm welcome back to the it's Cock Magic illegal? Championships. Well, Suddenly, sense. an electric atmosphere here in the basement of Panda Express. The fight we were expecting, of course, Gadnock, Breaker of Worlds. But that's a mob boss <laughs> making that announcement. That a nigga named Jimmy. This is ten-month-old Cornish Rooster McNuggets. In a complete shocker, the challenger McNuggets has Yo, been boss. scratched, and substituting for him is nine-year-old Kenny McCormick. Never right. a dull moment in the illegal sport of cock magic. Let's rejoin yeah, the battle illegal. now as we wait for Gadnuck's sixth move. So Kenny gonna have to beat this chicken in order to keep Nugget alive. Gadnock, Breaker of Worlds, plays a creature card. Jesus, Paragon of Fierce Defiance. Now every red creature Gadnock plays will have a plus one attack. Why am I so invested into this like I know what's going on? Is this a real, sp not a real sport, but is this real games? Like, do... Like, I, I I just want to know, you know what I'm saying? Like, Come is this on, real? Kenny. Like a real game. I like to play Pokemon cards when I was a kid. Yu-Gi-Oh was solid. Did he top all his mana? Dude, he just cast Psychogenic Probe. Now every time the other rooster has to shuffle his deck, he loses two health. He just had to shuffle it. Did you hear that? He's shuffling the deck already. The only thing he's got in the battleground now is an Overseer. Does an Overseer Damn. have trample? Does an Overseer have trample? Bro, stop screaming, bro. Elvish Mystic now, and Gadnook attacks with Merciful Pretender. McCormick sends Charging Rhino to the graveyard. He's desperate now. Oh, shit. Not too much he can... Oh, and he's just laid down <laughs> life's legacy. That was what does that mean? That was expected. Gadnook doesn't know what hit him. McCormick follows with crackling doom. And... I, I don't know what happened, but Kenny is whooping his ass. Abzan Battle Priest. Holy shit, dude. Gadnook tries to block with Living Totem, but... Oh! Dude, that nigga's just throwing cars out and shit, boy. This is a horrible spades game. I don't like it. Frenzied Goblin has been sent to the graveyard, and now there is no one to block Pearl Lake Ancient. Uh -huh. My God, someone has to put a stop to this. He's beating hey. that guy. <laughs> oh, shit. And y'all going to jail. Well, well. Looks like I finally <laughs> caught the big boys. You're all going to jail for a long time. Oh, no. Especially you, scumbag. Lousy cops, how did you find us? We saw your flyers. Panda Express, cock magic at 9 p.m. What? We put those flyers out. And now, for your halftime... Randy, you stupid! You so stupid! Oh, look, Randy is so stupid. Please welcome... <laughs> he was there the, the whole time. The beautiful, the amazingly Randy. Hi, uh, dude, your dad's here. <laughs> Thank you, hey! You know, <laughs> we live in a world of brutality and violence. And some people think there's no oh room God. for wonder anymore. Well, just for a moment, I want you to think one thing. Whatever you believe is real, <laughs> is real. <laughs> I don't. Oh, no. Oh, no. God. This is horrible. This was on TV, bro. <laughs> I don't want to watch this. It's magical. This <laughs> is some Mickey Mouse Fantasia shit right here, boy. <laughs> this is what I have for you. The hell is you popping out from? Come on, Barbie. Let no fuck you. You understand that? This is what I got for you, bro. I'm not gonna keep on playing. <laughs> I'm not playing, bro. That man is a free. But what did you pop from, bro? Do the twirl. Do your twirl, bitch. I want to see him do a twirl. And that's when I would have walked out. If I hadn't walked out before, that's when I would have walked out. Ah. All right, for this last She's bit, I'm to the need face. a volunteer. Anybody? No. Now, volunteer. I know you will, bitch. I know you will. All right, come on up here. Freaky What's your ass name? dude. I'm Detective Harris, South Park Police. All right, a hand for Detective Harris. They just sneaking out. 
You know, if there's one thing I could leave Smart. you all with, it's this. Let cock magic be done by the professionals. Sir? Sir? I would never. I could never. Bro, what is this? Hey, hey, did you see him, Detective Hill? <laughs> Bitch! And look, he loved it. He loved it. And look, they loved it too. When you go to Panda Express, this is this is a reminder for everybody. I'm not going there anymore. Moving forward, if you go to Panda Express and you end up in the basement, you're only going to have a dick in your mouth. What was that? He's a little... <laughs> Why are you so happy that that was there, bro? I... Look, you got to die after that. You understand? You have to... Whatever, bro. And, and this this is obviously so a, a fictional you thing, YouTube. Kenny laid waste to Gadnock Breaker of Worlds. It got so out of hand that the f***ing cops had to come and break it up. Wow, the cops came? Yeah, it was seriously the most manly thing that's ever happened. Kenny cast okay. Glacial Crasher and then Stan's dad shot his dick off. I just, I seriously okay. don't know where we go from here. You I really right, don't. Yeah, okay. I guess I don't know. Hey, yeah, what about poor McNuggets? How did they get that approved for TV is what I want to know. What's he going to do now? Wait a minute. I've got it, you guys. Got what? A way to Chicken. finally do something good for other people. Interesting. Well, South Park serves, and McNuggets plays a plane's land card. Okay. One nil, South Park. Okay. Well, hey, whatever, Another man. Serve. Whatever works. And McNuggets summons Down Treader Elk. One South Park player is eliminated. You, the girl with the ponytails, you are dead. <laughs> okay. Well, hey, that's kind of interesting. I'm not. I'm not even gonna lie. Like this, it's stupid. But it's kind of interesting. It's kind of interesting. Like, I, I was I was a little bit invested in that little clip that I seen. I probably wouldn't watch it, obviously. But there's a little. I was a little bit invested, even not even knowing what the hell is going on. But, y'all, man, that's the video for the day. Randy's a freak. Mr. Garrison is still on the shit list. Um, the, the Asian man that's not so Asian, that's kind of Brock, but not Brock. <clears throat> He's the worst. I got to go revisit. I got to revisit his episode. I got to see who are the worst characters, who are the freakiest characters in South Park, bro. Because I have to see, bro. It's, we have to make a list. Like, the, the, the Butters is somehow on the list because he's just, that whole thing with it. Butters' grandma is on the list. She's on the list. Just, we got, I need some help, bro. Y'all need to help. I need some help. Go over to the Discord and help your boy out. And go over to the Patreon if you just want to see more, if you want to see this in advance, bro. But I love y'all, and I will see y'all in the next video.